Hello guys and should I say hello from the airport? I am currently in the airport with my family. We are on our way to Dubai for my mom's birthday and for Nathal's birthday. I have not had any time to update you guys since Sunday. It is Wednesday today. But um oh wow. <laughs> um, but yeah, we are on our way to Dubai. We're gonna go through immig not immigration, through customs now, and then immigration. The lines are crazy. Um, yeah, the lines are crazy. The Emirates line just to check out bags in was like nice. So yeah, I will see you guys in the slow lounge. to our hotel this hotel is insane. insane it is absolutely insane it is so gorgeous it's a new hotel it's called the Lana by the Dorchester group and our insane. rooms insane <laughs> <laughs> it's just crazy like okay so I'm gonna give you a room tour uh, how walking into things here so you have these two double doors here you open these doors and then you walk in and this is what the room looks like you can see we've already made ourselves at home and it does look a little bit untidy already but it is absolutely gorgeous look at this wow and they've also given us some like yeah desserts there was a baklava i ate the baklava and that was just amazing okay vlogging on the camera and then didn't want to focus on the view but then i wanted to show you this how crazy is this so we don't have a view of the burj but marina is there and then the burj is obviously on that side like going that way but this is so beautiful let me show you the bathroom the bathroom is also just insane shower oh it opens this way you know if you want to have a sit down a little cry in the shower or something there's a bench in there then there's a bathroom toilet and then this is crazy but the craziest thing is this how insane wow the content is gonna be content here guys just saying this is so so stunning we were just saying sitting and talking now and we're saying how blessed we are to be able to do this and to be able to experience this we are here for my mom's 60th and for Nathal's 28th birthday and it's just crazy to us that we are able to do this and I think I just want to share it with you guys yeah we're just so thankful and just thankful for you guys as well because we wouldn't be able to do this without you either so yeah we're just so thankful for it Nathal's just living his best life here yeah? best birthday life <laughs> Technically, you're already 28. Mm, no. 
Yes. Can I tell Tiffany? <laughs> They're here to help us open the door because we can't figure out how to open the door. <laughs> this is great. Happy birthday! <laughs> <laughs> Donkey. Show us some dance moves. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Today is my husband's birthday and yes, we are in Dubai. I get to spoil this man today and I'm very excited to do that. If you watched our first Dubai vlog, you would know that we are here for my mom's birthday and Nadal's birthday. And every year it's always a challenge to surprise both of them and to make each of their days special. This year, my hubby's only request was to do something active and something that he loved. So my idea was to take him to Top Golf and boy did we have a great time it was such a cool experience honestly even for people that are not very comfortable with playing golf or going to a driving range it was a lot of fun we also splurged a little bit and got the vip experience where they give you like a fruit plate and come and sing happy birthday for you they also like do a little sign on the field that says happy birthday it was so cute said happy birthday Nathal with a cake and he was so surprised and he just had such a good time and we all practiced our shots he helped us to figure out how to do it properly it was very cute him training all of us but we had such a good time and obviously he beat all of us because he is the better golfer he does this more often than we do but yes, it was such a good experience. And Top Golf, you guys, your service was impeccable. We paid nothing extra above what we paid for the tickets already. So it was a wonderful experience. And then we got home, and the Lana had put balloons in the room. And um, shout out to Emilio. But yeah, that's it. Love you. Bye. Wow, we've already been here for two days, and I have not updated you guys on basically anything. I apologize but I've been living in the moment it's been so amazing it's been my mom's birthday and Nathal's birthday it's currently my mom's birthday and we just had lunch at a place called Tomoka in JBR at the Ritz Carlton so beautiful and the food was so good it's just like Peruvian South American food amazing and let me show you my view I don't know why I can't show you my view okay well at least it's making it's focusing on my face but um, yeah I I've been trying to create content uh, it's <laughs> It's not been working so much. I've had a little bit of a, I don't know, anxiety. I had a little bit of anxiety getting here. Um, yeah, I feel like I've had a little bit of anxiety over the past two days. I do think that that's because that I had some work that I hadn't. Hey guys, editing Taz here. Um, I just realized that one of the clips completely cut off because I had no memory on the memory card that I was using and then I just swapped to the rest of the birthday footage so I will explain why I had anxiety about this trip at the end of the video so okay love you bye Yeah. <laughs> and 
video but wow yay Hello guys, I am reporting live from Johannesburg because I did not finish off the vlog in Dubai. Um, I have no idea, I haven't even sorted through the footage yet, but today is Friday the, what is today's date? The 20th of September, we were in Dubai over the weekend of the 14th. 13th 14th so it's been a week since we've been back from Dubai not a week we go we came back on Wednesday um, yeah but the past few days have been a little bit crazy I feel like Dubai was so last not last minute but like it was so rushed and I had so much work to do while I was in Dubai like I had a client that needed content by Friday I missed the deadline and I got them the content by Sunday afternoon thank God um, it was my fault obviously I mean can I say it was my fault or there was a lot of circumstances <laughs> that contributed to me missing this deadline like we had no water the whole of the week of the 6th to the 13th there was no water no, the 6th, no. From like, yeah, from the 6th, there was no water. So, like, I couldn't do anything. It's a skincare, it was a skincare campaign. You would have seen it already. It's for La Roche-Posay. Yeah. I just feel like I couldn't create properly because I couldn't shower. I couldn't do anything. I kept having to come and shower by my mom. And... Everything was just a mess. The house was a mess. My life was a mess. Everything that I was trying to get ready for the trip was just all over the place. I couldn't do anything properly. It was crazy. I was even contemplating like us going to a hotel early, like booking into a hotel for a few days before we leave to Dubai. And then that wouldn't have worked either because Dumbledore would be with us. So none of my solutions worked. My mom doesn't really have a spare room for Natal and I. So we couldn't go stay there for a few days. So we were just up and down between her house and our house. And it was just such a problem carting things up and down. And on top of everything, Natal had work. Like he had his job to go to. So yeah, it was, it was not fun. Oh, there's a lady coming to park next to me now. Okay, well. Mm. Okay. Mm, baby, you'll shy. <laughs> okay, she's gone. <laughs> I'm ridiculous, I swear. I don't know what it is about vlogging with other people watching me that I get scared. Like, even when I was in Dubai, I was getting scared to vlog with Nathal watching me. That's so stupid. Like, he sees me do such stupid things during the day and I'm scared to, like, talk to a camera in front of him. What the hell? Okay, so, yeah, as I was saying, uh, 
like there was just so much going on in Dubai. And I also wanted to be present because it was my, obviously my mom's birthday and Nathal's birthday. And I just wanted to be, I wanted to be there with them. And I guess normally I can, normally I can compartmentalize. But I think I had so much on my plate that my mind was so scattered. So I had to choose one or the other. Either it was content or it was being present with my family and i did create content you guys will get lots of tiktok vlogs and i'm sure that i would have put the tiktok vlogs in this vlog like i'm sure you would have seen it yeah um but yeah i am going to go do groceries now we didn't do groceries <laughs> before we left to dubai so literally the fridge is empty she's like empty empty and so is the freezer i'm trying to hold out till next week uh, till like all our payments and stuff come in to do a bulk shop because um i say this all the time like you know you have money in your account but spending money right now makes you feel like you're broke even though you wouldn't be if you spend that money. Does that make sense? Like, I think it's just a stress thing. <laughs> like a stress response to spending. I don't know. And I know it's on food, so it's not like I don't need it. <laughs> but <laughs> yeah, I'm just trying to I'm just trying to be prudent and not um order Uber Eats every day. Instead cook. And I'm back on my bullshit with the diet with my diet or my eating plan I had such a bad allergic reaction I have no cooking clue I had hives all over my body while I was in Dubai I don't know what caused it I don't know if it's shellfish I have to try and eat the shellfish and see if that is the case it didn't cause anaphylaxis so it didn't cause like closing of the throat or the airway or anything it was just the hives but yeah, I, yeah, what was I saying? I have to do, I have to go full on elimination diet. So I started yesterday. I also started with 10,000 steps a day yesterday. I reached um, my goal for yesterday. I need to still do my 10,000 steps for today. I probably will reach it because I'm going to go walk around in Nickelway now. So I will probably reach it sooner than I anticipate. But yeah, let's go do some grocery shopping. I was going to meet me here for some lunch because neither of the two of us have eaten. I ate a piece of salmon for breakfast this morning, but that's about it. Um, but yeah, let's go.
Hey guys, I'm sitting in editing and I realized that I did not finish off the vlog yesterday. I just want to say thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate all the love that I've been getting on YouTube lately. Um, I skipped last week for an upload because I was in Dubai. <sighs> Sorry, I just walked up the stairs. <laughs> but I really appreciate you guys and I will see you guys next week. I'm about to start a new vlog. So... See you soon. Love you. Bye.